Hey everybody, I am David, and uh, you know, I love fan theories, you know, there's some really great fan theories out there, uh, but there's one fan theory I just can't connect to, and uh, that is the Pixar theory. Uh, <laughs> this is a very popular theory out there that all the Pixar films are connected, and uh, I think it's been debunked recently, although I heard the people at Pixar love to play around with the idea. Um, <laughs> no. To me, it's it's a theory that is so flawed, I can't go with it, not even for fun, because there's things that bug me. And l first off, let's get through with this Cars scenario. I know I made a video about why do people hate the Cars franchise. I enjoy the Cars franchise, even the second one, which I'll admit is the weakest Pixar film of all time. I still find some enjoyment from it. Uh, but the idea that the Cars or machines have taken over the Earth and then that's somewhere after the events of like Toy Story and all that and b before WALL-E. Uh, no, I, uh, I just, no, that doesn't make sense to me. There's things there that are just, I mean, this is an animated cartoon film. And I know it's fun to think about, I get it, but there's things there that don't make sense. The cars are too nice of characters to have killed off humans or to have this war with humans or whatever. Uh, I mean, I get it. I get the idea that, like, the, the toys from Toy Story and the animals, like, all of them don't like humans. They don't trust you. Well, the toys do, but the, the animals don't. I don't know. Even thinking about it, trying to talk about it right now, it just it boggles my mind. And I just look at the Cars franchise as its own thing. They're off in their own little universe. That's how I look at the Cars franchise. And then there's the whole Monsters, Inc. aspect of that theory where they talk about how Monsters, Inc. is actually in the far, far future. Like, beyond uh, WALL-E. And um, how the doors are actually... Uh, portals to the past. <sighs> I mean, these are creative theories. I'm not going to knock them down on how creative they are. It is it is interesting to think about. It. it is fun to think about. But at the end of the day, I don't know. There's just something about it that I don't... I think some of the films are better left in their own little world. Uh, I think you can connect them if you want. I think the Cars franchise is the only one that you would have to take out of there, though, out of the equation. I don't think that fits in any continuity at, at all. I think it's its own thing. That's why Planes is is in there, too, to, you know, well, the other Pixar movies aren't connected to it. Well, this one is. And I think The Good Dinosaur is another one that's like on its own as well because apparently that's a world where what if the uh, the meteor that wiped out the dinosaurs didn't kill the dinosaurs the dinosaurs would continue to go on even that one i consider its own thing i think the rest of them though you can connect them if you really want to but i don't see why people would want to connect these films just look at them uh, as their own individual thing i mean that's the fun thing about i think these pixar films um, because w when I try connecting them or thinking about this Pixar theory, it just, my mind goes berserk. Uh, I just, I can't handle it. I can't. It doesn't make sense to me. It, it makes sense, but it doesn't make sense because there's things that contradict it and there's things that I don't like. I don't know. Uh, man, uh, the Pixar theory, it's, it's a giant headache. That's all I have to say about it. Um, but hey, if you guys like the Pixar theory, don't let my opinion on it ruin your uh, watchability factor on it. Hey, some people like the Pixar. A lot of people like the Pixar theory. I mean, those videos. That video is much more higher than any video I have done. So they clearly did something that connected to a lot of people. Uh, but I want to see if there's people out there like me that do not like the Pixar theory and that feels. Uh, the way that I do about it, where, uh, no, no, it doesn't make sense. Um, I don't know. So that's why I'm making this video, to see if there's anybody else there out there 
that feels that way and that just wants to look at all the Pixar movies as their own little thing. Um, with that being said, subscribe to my channel if you are a huge Pixar fan. Because believe me, I am a huge Pixar fan. I might not agree with the Pixar theory, but um, it's something that's been lingering my mind for quite some time. Especially since Cars 3 came out a few weeks ago like two weeks ago or something uh it kind of crept back into my head um so i mean whenever a pixar movie comes up uh you can bet the pixar theory is not too far behind because people are trying to cram the new pixar movie I in the timeline so uh like this video if you agree with me don't dislike it you can like it also if you disagree with me why not and until next time, guys, take care.